The city sees a lot of activity on its beaches this time of year, but what most visitors don't always expect or maybe not always take into account, seeing the beaches overrun with water due to coastal flooding. Yeah, the winds and high tide are proving to be a disappointment among visitors hoping for sunny skies and much more. Of course, lower tides. Our Simone Simpson was out at JP Luby Beach and has this report. from within the city and out of town are coming to the beach for some fun, but they're finding out it appears to be more water than there is beach. It's honestly shocking, but you know, we're making the best of it. It's, we're having fun still. What wasn't fun was the condition of the beach yesterday. Even crazier, it was just so gray and water and wind was just the wind was pushing all the water and you couldn't even drive. Some drivers found themselves in a similar situation today. The car next to us just got stuck, so we just had to strap onto them and pull them out of the, the water. Joan Silva is visiting from San Antonio. They're sinking into the beach because the tides are so crazy today. Her family's spring break plans are not going quite as planned. We plan to stay a couple days, but we may go home early because the wind is not dying down. It's, it's not fun coming here all the way from San Antonio just to be in the hotel room. Vienna Sardinas and her family are amongst dozens making the best of the beach's conditions. Corpus Christi is usually her family's ideal destination for a getaway. My go to destination for beach and vacation, short vacations. Simone Simpson, 3 News. Thank you, Simone, for that. Just take a look at that surf.